given the um, discord in Congress and the gridlock, how likely do you think it is that they could come up with, they could actually agree on a replacement plan in the near term? Anybody? Senator Portman has joined with other Republicans in Congress to ask for several months, I think until May, for a discussion. We find that very hopeful. Um, we want to see a replacement, and Senator Portman is uh, working to try to make that happen. So um, yeah, that would give a few months. It's a big law, but um, it's a move in the right direction. I think, I think looking at past performance is another indicator of what's possible. I mean, we had uh, uh, over a year debate uh, for the ACA. Now, things are moving faster today than they were in 2008 and 9 when the law came into existence. So, I, you know, is it, is it reasonable that Senator Portman and Ken Company to get this done? I like that timing better than just repealing it. What elements of the ACA do you believe are necessary to stay in place in a new form? There are many elements that are necessary. Um, we emphasize the importance of maintaining the Medicaid expansion and the subsidies on the marketplace. Many people talk about the critical need to maintain uh, coverage for people with pre-existing conditions, as the pastor talked about. There are many interwoven parts. I, I think interwoven is a good, good word and why we need to have a discussion, because if you remove the wrong piece, it becomes a game of Jenga and everything falls to the ground. And I think we need to be careful about what we do to, to the structural foundation of the ACA uh, before repealing portions of it. And as part of that, I think that focus on access and prevention are critical both from the you know, immediacy perspective of making sure people have health care, but also from that long-term perspective of decreasing costs and having a sustainable system where everyone has access because it's the preventive care that really has that great opportunity to do so. So on the opposite side, are there certain pieces that you'd like to see improved upon or if they repeal it, not carried over into whatever that new law might be? I'd like to see continued um, focus on um, developing the primary care workforce um, through things like the patient-centered medical homes and expanding upon that. I think we've learned a lot of lessons on things that work with the Affordable Care Act that can be um, moved forward. Yeah, I, I second that, the innovative pieces of the Accountable Care Act. So sorry, the Affordable Care Act should, should be considered. There are some true success, successes in that innovation piece. And then I think the stability of the insurance marketplace should, should be looked at. And if we don't have providers who are willing to cover these folks, uh, access is going to be limited. So. I think the competition between health insurance companies should be increased. Uh, the Affordable Care Act was purported to be based on competition among the insurance companies through the state exchanges. Uh, without those state exchanges, you don't have uh, the necessary competition. So they also need to discuss how they're going to increase the competition among the companies to keep the cost of premiums down. Thank you, everybody.